Okay, you can just here to set your questions on the game. You can put your hand up. Sure, that you feel hard done by, so I'm not getting all three points. Of course. I mean, how do you explain that? I don't. I don't. I only can explain the work my team did. Amazing control of a team that is very good. A team that normally produces very good attacking football and um, was completely, completely controlled. Um, we didn't see amazing players. We didn't see them. So completely under control. When um, we lost the ball, our reaction to that moment was amazingly good. So, so aggressive, so intense that we didn't give them chances to, to build from, from the back. And when we had the ball, we produced good football. We had good situations, we had good chances. And um, we should score before the one nil. We should score after the one. After the one nil, and we should win the game comfortably. So I feel very disappointed for the players, very disappointed for the fans. But um, I think we have amazing fans. The way they react after after this defeat um, is amazing because um, they know the players they did a fantastic a fantastic work and they can control their disappointment with the result to praise the players and the players performance so we are unlucky with the results but we are lucky with the fans we have i remember some matches uh, here last season a couple of seasons ago where the team won and people was not happy. Um, and the way we played Burnley, Stoke and, and Arsenal, but I focus on Arsenal because Arsenal is the game today and, and, and the big team that we dominate quite so easily is very frustrating. So I'm happy with the players. I have nothing, absolutely nothing to say against my players. But I feel sorry for them because um, we feel like we feel like a defeat, and for sure Arsenal is is feeling like a, like a victory. Can I ask about the penalty in the first half? You know, maybe you know what I told before to to, to some televisions. Uh, I like the words that Mariner told us before the game, and it was very simple. I don't want to be the man of the match. I don't want to be seen. I want you to help me to do a to do a good a good work. And I think this is Andre Mariner. He tries always <coughs> he tries always to be a referee with a lot of balance. I know I know that is or isn't a penalty. I watch on the video a few times so I know. But um, I don't want to say what 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 I think, and I want to reaffirm that the referee tried to do his best. Jose, Jose could you just, regardless of results, Jose, do you feel that you're making the right kind of progress? Look, um, Jones and Rojo. I think probably many of you, you would think Jones doesn't play two matches in a row for two or three years. Rojo, nobody knows what he is, because sometimes he plays here, sometimes he plays there, sometimes he's in the stands, sometimes he's at home. So when you see these two players perform the way they, uh, they did, you know that there's work behind it. Uh, the way we, we are positive when we recover the ball, you know that there's work behind it. To create chances, you know that there's work behind it. And um, we know, we all know, inside, internally, we all know that in this moment we are the unlucky team in the Premier League. We know that. We just focus on Burnley, Stoke and Arsenal. 
nine points easily, not difficult, nine points easily. We have six points more. If we have six points more, we are top four and close to the to the top of the league. So we have a lot of work to do. We know that. We know that. We have a lot of work to do. We have lots of improvements to do. We have lots of kids that um, are um, mistake prone because belongs to belongs to to, to the youth uh, players. We also know that we have some amazing players that turn the 33, 34 year old barrier. We know, we know that other teams are <coughs> are prepared with much different conditions than, than we are. How long is Mr. Wenger with, with this team? Uh, how long is uh, Mauricio with this, with this team at Tottenham? How long is um, Klopp with, with this team? Um, at Chelsea and Arsenal, Chelsea and uh, and Liverpool, they don't play in Europe. They have one week to to work, one week to rest, one week to prepare. If you remember what Brendan Rodgers did with Liverpool two seasons ago, also in a season where Liverpool didn't had Europe to play, they are in a much privileged position to to work and to improve uh, that teams. The level of experience of Man City, um, you know, we are in a in a very difficult Premier League, where I know the players know, the board knows, the owners know. By the reaction of the public, the public knows, the Man United fans know. You know, but you don't want to say, or you don't know, but. We are very confident. We are very, very, very happy with with our work, and um, better, better results will arrive for sure. When you say the young players are mistake prone, you must have had a very good game, but he lets Oxford change and get away from them. Exactly. It's no. It's, it's normal. It's normal. He's a he's a young um, he's a young kid. He's a kid that I put the last minutes on on the left side because I know that. He has the pace to cope with the, with the progression of of a full back, but um, you know can happen. Chamberlain, good player, fast, fresh. Marcos is not a a defender. He was catched in a in a left back position. Then the cross, and then we we don't have um, very strong people in in the air to cope with with the cross. I don't have on the bench. A physical player to play like I would if I have Fellaini, I would play Fellaini for the last 10-15 minutes in that in that area. But you know, is a is a is an isolated action in a game where everything was under control and in a period where everything was under control. Because sometimes last five minutes you feel the normal pressure of an opponent. That's that was not the case. That was not the case at all. Okay, guys, thank you. Thank you. So finally, I lost against Arsenal. <laughs> finally, I lost against Arsenal. That's the feeling I go home, is that finally I lost against Arsenal. <laughs>